able to scramble back in their net in time, and you can tell when a goalie's hesitant compared to confident the way that Chan is. The Friars give that one up, and that one is roofed. Oh, by Martha Bobaric. First goal of the season. Might be the first of her career. And a tremendous one to give the lead back to the Huskies. Beautiful. She gets down to a knee. She lifts this off the bar and in, and you see her go through the uh, One that opened up with under two to go, nearing one to go in this second period. Makoka has fired it in, bounced it in. It falls for Hammer, and she pots it for the second of the night. Second of the year for Brooke Hammer. Started with Makokis, got tipped by, I think, a defenseman in front. Initial save by Wagner, but it came right to Hammer. And left as... point, fires it down along the boards. Final 18 seconds. Clark trying to muscle her way in. Puck is loose, and in! The Friars tie things up, Sarah Davies knocks it home, which is 12.6 seconds left. The Friars not giving up, playing to the very end of this period and tying it up once again. That come from behind fashion the same way they did against another ranked team on Tuesday against Quinnipiac. Davies working so hard to get that puck on the rebound, forcing her way to the front of the net. A conference is competitive is this one. Oh, yeah. Krovo now. Made a move. Worked on it and scores. It's Emily Krovo again, driving down the left wing, and that's how they were able to tie up the game. Her resilience driving through the left wing, through that left face-off circle. Here in a row. Thompson, nice work in center. Gets into the zone, good pass across for Shannon. They score! Oh, what a brilliant setup! My goodness, what a goal to tie this game! You'll see some good goals throughout this season in Hockey East. This one is an early season candidate for play of the year. How quick is the wow. release on that? And then putting it right in the upper right-hand corner of the net.